In this short video, I just want to walk you through uh, just the top half of this table. Uh, this just compares the, the various types that we've looked at. WEP, uh, which supposedly ensured wired-like privacy in wireless. Um, you know, in a way you could say it does because wired by itself without some sort of encryption is not that secure, right? So, yeah, it kind of does that. It uses that RC4 encryption. Uh, for authentication, it uses either an open standard or that shared standard. Now, that shared standard is where it gives you a number that you have to type into your computer. You don't get to choose it. It just gives it to you. Now, when WPA came out, again, 802.11i was the project that IEEE started that um, started to try to develop something that was better than WEP. Uh, so the 802.11i first came out with this RC4 plus TKIP, which took that initialization vector, encrypted it, and, and attached it, or actually incorporated it inside the authentication um, key for WPA. So for encryption, it's using that TKIP plus RC4. For authentication, it's using the um, pre-shared key. So the pre-shared key now is that one that you type into your router and you type into your computer. It also had the capability of WPA Enterprise, and this is the use of that AAA server so that everybody can have their own logon and another server can do the authentication rather than the router itself. And then WPA2 came along, and again, uh, this was part of the 802.11i standard. It used AES encryption and something called CCMP, um, which I did not go into, but CCMP um, is it's kind of like the TKIP, or it's kind of like the, the initialization vector, so to speak, only for AES. Um, and then it also has both a personal version and an enterprise version. The personal version is you put in a password, and the enterprise version is where it's using a AAA server. Now WPA3 uses uh, something called GCMP256. We haven't talked about that encryption type, uh, but it also has a personal and enterprise version. And these things are subject to change because this really isn't out yet. Uh, I mean, it is out, but it's it's likely to change more uh, over the next few years. So it's still up and coming. 